Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com coming at you with a full case break. This is our second to last case of 2018 Topps Finest Baseball. There it is. 14th, 2018 Topps Finest Baseball. If we pull any of those teams, these are non-auto teams right here. Um, you know what I'm going to do? One, two, three, four teams right here. In fact, any cards that come out for these four teams will randomize it to one person in the break. So one person getting a bonus four teams. That's pretty cool. Might just be inserts. All right. Good luck, everybody. Wait, so Sooner is saying you took a photo of me in L.A. and you're going to email it to me? No, I'd rather not. That's kind of creepy. I'd rather not indulge that. <laughs> All right. Good luck, everybody. Break 10. I, I will post our last case of Finest Baseball um, after this break. So stay tuned for that, and you'll be able to get into the last case the finest baseball. Good luck, everyone. Hey, that would be great. That would be great if a one-of-one one came out for those teams, Andy. Because then everyone's going to be like, oh, I should have bought those teams. I was like, you should have. Or at least join the break, because that's going to get randomized to one person in the break. Well, we got two more chances, Arthur. This break, and then if you get the dime back to the next break, a couple more chances. All right, good luck, everybody. We've got Jose Ramirez, 209 out of 250. That'll go to the tribe. That'll be for Arthur. Oh, 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 at the rookie premiere with the... I see. All right. You have to excuse me, Sooner KJ. <laughs> There's the email in the chat. All right, that makes sense. It's the price of fame, Sooner KJ. The price of fame. Harrison Bader. You never know who's... I mean, I'm kind of a big deal out here, Sooner. So... You can email that to us at jazbeeshobby at gmail.com. 43 out of 150. All customer service inquiries could go there too, ladies and gentlemen. Harrison Bader. Cardinals. That'll be for the Ryan Redman. Redman with the Red Birds. There's Goldie, Refractor. Boom, Arthur. Boom. Whoa, Joe P., family show. Easy with those master jokes. Yeah, well, you're gonna see some. You got got some Goldie for Arthur right here, refracting Goldie. Yeah, I'm pop. I'm popular with the with the teenage girl demographic. T Todd Todd's kids think I'm a star. Clayton Kershaw, Dodgers, goes to Scott McNulty. Fix that back, Clayton. Max Scherzer. Right. You meant Mr., right? Joe P. Family show. Easy. Jack Flaherty. Todd's Todd's daughters are watching Joe P. Come on. They think I'm cool. 
won't be too long before they realize I'm not. Jack Flaherty for the Redbirds. Redmond with the Redbirds. Arthur likes the joke, Jofi. I, I have tried to... I've been trying to think of a clever way to... A, cl a clever way to get that in there, but... I don't know. You just kind of forced it, Jofi. That wasn't subtle at all. I, I've been trying to think of a way to, to work that in there, but I just haven't found... I haven't found a way... Like, I was always waiting for, like, some article about, you know, Harrison Bader, like, mastering the art of bunts or something like that. <laughs> and that could work that in there. But no, no such headline has appeared, Joe P. It appears as if the newspapers of America are, uh, are far too mature for that. At least the headline writers are. All right. Good luck, folks. There's Alex Verdugo, Refractor, and J.P. Crawford to 250. 181 to 250. What, what is that, his batting average? 181? hey oh, <laughs> Phillies, that goes to DMAC. Just like throwing shade at J.P. Crawford. Although he's supposed to be... I mean, I, I know he's still young, but he's supposed to be a uh, pretty big prospect for the Phillies. He's got time. He's still young. Verlander. Joe P with the with the rim shot there, the drum roll. Oh, out of five? Joey Votto, behind Joey Votto, a two out of five. Baboom! Baboom. Paul Blackburn for the Oakland A's. Wit with a train whistle. Wit, wit, a train whistle. A train whistle. Look at that. All aboard! Woo woo! Nice. <laughs> I know, Joe P. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? There's Kevin Pilar to 150. I mean, it's Valley for the Valley for the A's, Joe. That's great Valley for the A's. Kevin Pilar for the Blue Jays. Oh, that is that is part of the winner take all randomizer for the for the for the teams that didn't sell. And we got CT three Chris Taylor. Chris Taylor for the Dodgers going to Scott McNulty. All right, and there's Ryan McMahon. All right. Next one. Hey, you're welcome, Wit. Whoa, that CT3 junk auto. Joe P agrees. Come on, Diamondbacks fans. Arthur, you sure you want still want that Goldschmidt auto? Keep talking like that. Goldschmidt auto might end up in the garbage. Goldschmidt auto that'll pull you. Easy. Your Diamondbacks buddy, Joe P, not helping either. Definitely end up in the garbage. Paper shredder, maybe. And put it on video. That would be hogwash. That's one of my favorite Joe P sayings. Hogwash. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Arthur says if I do that, he'll drive out here and throw me in the trash. Also, I think Arthur is actually visiting in the next week or so. I got to be nice. No, I traded him, Joe P. I, I, that was last week. I didn't let you guys know. I had to. My fantasy team was awful. 
It was awful. And he, he, he was, his salary was too high in my 16 team auction keeper league. So I, I would, we were, I was like in second to last place. I had to move him and, and a number of other assets, uh, to get Manny Machado and Mookie Betts, who I can keep next year for next, next year in the mid thirties, because I, I wasn't going to be able to keep Goldschmidt for like eighty seventy dollars next year. I just wasn't going to do it. It made sense. The league understood under the parameters of the league. There's Jackie Bradley Jr. out of 250. It made sense. It's actually working out. Miguel Sano reveals a Ryan McMahon out of 150. One of the nicest autos in the hobby. Like no, like no sarcasm. I actually like his auto a lot. It's, it's nice. Paul Coolwit with the Rockies. It wasn't no faith. I knew that he was going to... What's the opposite of regress to the mean? I, I knew he would go back to the mean. You know, it's not like he was going to hit 180 the entire season. Like, he's going to aver he's going to hit 300, right? So, he's going to have to hit 350 at some point. 360. Which is what he's doing now. <laughs> Alright, there's behind David Robertson is... Cornerstones, Buster Posey for Scott McNulty and the Giants out of 50. That card is gold. Progress to the mean? Progress to the mean? Or progress to the mean? 10 out of 50. You can regress to the mean. I guess it would be a regression. Just a positive. It's a positive regression to the mean. Stats, guys. Talk to me. There's Nick Williams out of 150. I need some, I need some stats, guys, in the data anal uh, analytics industry for the right wording on that. Progress tonight? I, I usually say progress to them. Alright, behind Goldie, speaking of Goldschmidt, there's JP Crawford, refractor autograph for DMAC. And the fight and fills. That's right, yeah, Curtis. I need I need top men on this. Top men. All right, next box. By the way, if you're keeping score at home, in you know, in nine cases, in fact, nine and a half at this point, nine and a half cases, we have not seen an Otani autograph. Not a one. We've seen some low number parallel, lower number parallels out of like two fifty or something like that. <laughs> yeah, Curtis, family show. Watch out. Can't just say, can't say top men out here. Easy. <laughs> Before you start emailing me, parents, that's an Indiana Jones reference. So, relax. Relax. Ar Ar Arthur's got... <laughs> yeah, we're not, we're, we're not in the hills or the valley. All right. So, our Otani count, zero autographs. He can sign cards. He just can't throw a baseball right now. He'll be fine. I wonder if they'll, I wonder if they'll still have him hit. Like if if they're like, oh well, you know, just DH. If the elbow doesn't require surgery, they may shut him down for for pitching even even then. But if he doesn't require surgery, maybe they'll be like, you can still hit, but just don't pitch the rest of the season. Possibly. Although they need his arm more. I think uh, Garrett Richards just got injured too. Curtis asking, why would you want a card of a guy not even playing ball? Because it's not like he's gonna it's not like it's a career ending injury. He's still gonna play baseball. <laughs> Curtis says just send him back. Just return postage for Otani. Sorry, damage. Get like an Amazon refund right there. Out of 150. 93 out of 150, Odubel Herrera. See, there you go. See, Cody West says, guy at local high school missed pitching his old junior year but can still hit and plays for the Pawtucket Red Sox now. See? There you go. Uh, that goes to the Phillies as well, DMAC. So you can't still you can't still hit, which is why I, I kind of think is what I think the, the Angels are hoping for. 
Behind Robinson Cano is Max Fried. 65 out of 99. Max Fried. Fried eggs. Uh, Robert Rohr with that one. Hey, all good, Cody. All good. Hey, there's Goldie, Arthur. See? Found him. Got him. Got him! There's Anderson Simmons. There is Nick Williams. A lot of Phillies parallels, D-Mac. Out of 99. I thought there was another card behind there. There was not. There's Giancarlo Stanton sitting red. And behind Mike Trout, his teammate maybe? Come on, teammate, 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 teammate. No, Brian Anderson. That goes to the Marlins, though. Hirokawa with the Brian Anderson refractor autograph. Marlins. The Marlins. All right, halfway through this eight box break, pick your team 10. After this break is over, I'll be posting the next Finest Baseball, which will be our last Finest Baseball. So stick around to the end of this break if you're watching live. If you're watching the replay later on, maybe a couple days later, today's a Thursday, maybe you're like, oh man, so did I miss it? Probably, probably. But you never know, check back on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Always something to do there. Um, yes, Case Hit is still out there. Case Hit is still out there. That's the finest hour autograph. Is there usually a bonus auto box per break? I don't know if that's one per one per case, but we have not seen one of those either. That would make Arthur happy, Joe P, if we pull the Goldie Finest. Does he have a Finest Hour autograph? I don't think every team has a Finest Hour auto. All right. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. We've got Dallas Keuchel, 28 out of 99. And that'll go to Arthur and the Astros. Arthur, who are you searching for? In the, I've seen you get the Astros a handful of times. Is there anyone you're searching for in particular? Cody Bellinger, Refractor. And behind Josh Bell is Ozzie Albius. He's been crushing the baseball. Robert Rohr with the Bravos. Oh, not really. He, Arthur just has the Astros. Just have him. Robert Rohr with the Bravos. Nice. There's Billy Hamilton. There's Otani. And behind Andrew Benintendi is... Another Max Freed for Robert. Ah, uh, the Mariners had runners in scoring position, and now he looks like a double play. All right. So much for that. All right, now, Gilo, are you still there? He was saying earlier that I have an interesting, what, pack opening technique? He was saying that earlier. I caught that earlier, Gilo. I find your pack opening technique interesting. How so? How so? Um, keeping it saucy, does Bowman have one product a year? No. They have 
They have Bowman Baseball, Bowman Draft. They have Bowman Chrome. They have Bowman's Best. And I think maybe, maybe some others that I'm forgetting too, but those are the main ones that we do. Is that, is that a red parallel in there maybe? Another train whistle? Maybe. Or could just be the border of a, of a team right there. Oh, you hold it from the back and just rip it with the other hand like He-Man? I just found it to be faster. Right? If I hold it right here, so I'm not holding the corners or the edge of the card. I'm not gripping it that way. And so if I pull it this way, pull the pack that way. So I do that. This is slow motion right here. And if I pull it out, and I do this very quickly. If I pull it out and over, I don't hurt the corners of the cards. And I slide out this way. Again, not messing with the corners of the card. And then it's already right side up to put on a pack, on a stack. Like so. So that try that protects the the cards as much as possible. All right. It is a red. Two out of five. Behind Ahmed Rosario is Yoenna, his teammate, Yoenna Cespedes. Woo! That is for the Metropolitan Scott McNulty. Nice. All aboard. Whoop, whoop. It's a nice hit. Nice hit for the Mets. Oh, got to finish this side right here, although some of the cards are over there now. All right, behind Ryan Braun is Tyler Maley. For the Reds, Nick Stanley with the Red Legs. And now the other side. We got out of 99, Max Freed. Oh, is this the bonus auto box then? That's kind of an early, that's early for the auto. Another one for, for the Braves, Robert Rohr, starting his Max Freed personal collection, his PC. There's Longo to 250. That's for the Giants, Oppo Joe Mojo for Scott McNulty. And if you're keeping score at home, ladies and gentlemen, we have not pulled a Finest Careers die cut autograph of Calgary. We've pulled a few of these, but not, not an autograph version. But that'll go to EA and the O's. There's Otani. Is that the fine that that looks like the finest hour autograph, which falls one per case. And behind Chris Archer is Victor Robles. Nice one for Daniel Batera. And the Nationals, the Nats. Although Juan Soto has been kind of uh, taking Victor Robles' thunder. And he has, he's not even called up yet. All right, another Otani, though. Two boxes to go. Yeah, we're definitely due for an Otani as well. I mean, we've gone through almost... We've gone through nine cases and through six boxes of break 10. No, no, no Otanis yet. No, no Otanis. Show me Otanis. Show me the money. Has it been confirmed that he's getting Tommy John, or is it not? I don't think it's confirmed yet, right?
All right. Good luck, boys and girls. Here we go. Paul DeYoung refractor. And a gold Mikel Franco, 35 out of 50. Yeah, show me the Tannies. Show hey the Tannies. Mikel Franco for DMAC. Ooh, some orange. An orange auto. Behind Omar Mazzara. 17 out of 25. Raphael Devers for the Bow Sox. Scott McNulty with the Bow Sox. Nice Jaspy Orange parallel. That's what Topps calls it. I don't think they call it that, but I'm gonna get a phone call from Topps tomorrow. It makes it's not Jaspy Orange. Okay, don't 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 call it Jaspy Orange. There's Otani, different uh, parallel there, or insert set. Out of 250, Paul DeYoung for the Redbirds, for Redmond. <laughs> Car Blaster Sanford with the you had me at, you had me at Otani. Shut up, shut up. You had me at Otani. Should we just do more Jerry Maguire references? J.P. Crawford, Refractor. And behind Carlos Correa is... Bailamos. Let the rhythm take you over, Bailamos. I, I don't know what else he says after that. Or else I'd keep singing. Whether you like it or not. Nick Stanley with Raisel Iglesias. Probably has absolutely no relation. It might, that might even be offensive. Actually has no relation to Enrique Iglesias or even Julio Iglesias. None of the Iglesiases. I guess maybe distant relatives, I suppose, at some point. All right. You want more Iglesias? Well, I, I should learn the entire song then. Should I add that to the playlist? Maybe I'll play it right after this. It's a good song. All right. Let's see if we could pull a big hit out of here. That'll get everybody by la mosing. Joe P, you like that? That's a good one. It's a good turn of phrase there. It's a good, uh, good segue. <laughs> you would, no, it's, no. I think people would rather watch me bust open cases of uh, baseball cards rather than me sing Bailamos. All right. Good luck, boys and girls. Here we go. Last two mini boxes, last two autographs, and some parallels. Like Aaron Judge. All rise. 222 out of 250. Scott McNulty with the Bronx Bombers. We got another uh, Cal Ripken Jr. die cut. So I've not seen his autograph yet. I'm assuming some of these are numbered too, right? I haven't seen a parallel either. All right, and behind Noah Syndergaard, Paul Blackburn, refractor autograph for the A's. Wit, starting your Paul Blackburn PC. Maybe a rainbow. Got to find the super refractor. Bailamos. All right. And the next mini box, last mini box, Manny Machado Refractor, Ozzy Albius, rookie. Brett Gardner, Zach Granke, Paul DeYoung, Cody Ballinger. You know, we haven't seen any of those sitting red autographs either. And behind Cornerstones, Norma Bazzara is 
Travis Shaw for the Brew Crew. And that goes to Paul Cool Wit. Wit that one. And there you have it, folks. All right, now let's see who who wins the uh, who wins this and all the other teams. You might get a, like a stack of inserts and some other cards and whatnot. Let's go back to the list right here. Let's pull up random.org. Name on top will get everything. Let's sort by your first names. All right. Good luck, everybody. After seven times, two and a five, seven times, gets that Kevin Pillar out of 150 and then a bunch of inserts and rookie cards and refractors and whatnot. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. It goes to EA with all the, uh, with all the bonuses right there. So there you go, Eric. Congrats to you. Thanks for getting in. Boop, 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 boop. And there you have it. Thanks, everybody. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We will see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.